Hey YouTube, stay tuned if you want to see how I made this. First we want to get our bacon nice and crisp. Next we want to chop up our sausage and our onions and use some of that bacon grease to get that going. Once we get that going, next we're going to start adding our seasoning. And that's just a little black pepper, onion and garlic powder, chicken bouillon, and lari's. Next we want to add our peppers and our cabbage. Once you get your peppers and your cabbage to the texture that you want, I like mine to be a little crunchy, add your crunchy bacon. You want to give that a swirl if you would like and serve it up. The cabbage is ready to go. So it's the crunch for me. I gotta have the crunch. I do not like soggy cabbage. I'm sorry. So next I'm going to do regular schmegular jiffy in the box cornmeal. The only difference is I add a little more milk than what they recommend. Go ahead and brown your butter somewhat on the stove in the cast iron skillet so that when you pour that cornmeal mix in there it should be nice and crunchy on the outside and nice and soft and decadent on the inside. So I already have my oven ready to go on 400. My butter is turning brown, so I'm going to spread it around and I'm gonna get that cornmeal in there. So fresh out of the oven, you wanna get that butter swirled around there. Do not forget the edges because the edges will just help solidify that crunch on the edges of your cornbread I'm telling you it's it's delicious and this is just a box cornmeal it's nothing special I didn't add anything extra than you know the butter and the extra milk Hope you give it a try. Thanks for watching.